What's up, BuzzFeed? I'm Ross Lynch, and today we are here to read some thirst tweets. Here we go. How naughty are we gonna get here? The first one says, I so badly want to boop and kiss Ross Lynch's nose. That one's not that bad. I can understand that. Like, I guess I got a cute nose. That's pretty, uh, pretty innocent. Ross Lynch, if you see this, I'm free Thursday night. Are you free Thursday night? So I can take you out on Thursday night? If you're free, I'd like to hang out Thursday night. Please message me back if you're free Thursday night when I'm free. <laughs> I don't think I was free Thursday night. Uh, Thursday, I mean, if that was yesterday, we were playing San Francisco, which was actually a really, really great show. We had this song called San Francisco that we played in San Francisco. <laughs> the crowd went wild, it was good. Hot girls knew the choreography for Cruising for a Bruising from TV's movie because they had a crush on Ross Lynch. It was me, I'm hot girls. <laughs> That was so fun, doing cruising for a bruising. The only thing that sucked about it though, is I, um, like the night before, we were night swimming, and I went to do like a big swan dive in the pool, and I ended up stepping on a pool filter, and it took a few of my toenails with it. So next time you watch that performance, just know that I was hurting. <laughs> I was hurting, but it was so fun, man. Ross Lynch wearing a cowboy hat, 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 Ross Lynch wearing a cowboy hat. I don't know where that started. I think it was it was probably Harry Styles. I've, I've like seen pictures of Harry Styles wearing cowboy hats on stage too, but I swear every single night, five or six cowboy hats thrown at me. And it's kind of fun. You get like outfit changes mid, mid set. It's kind of cool. I'm kind of collecting them, I guess now. There's too many, so I usually pick like my favorites. Ross Lynch makes me go feral every time I see a picture of him. Like, why does he have this power over me? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just trying to have a good time. <laughs> just up there, dancing, singing, enjoying myself. I guess that's the, that's the secret. I remember Ross Lynch in Teen Beach Movie specifically being my biggest sexual awakening. It's all his fault. <laughs> that movie's like really innocent too. You know what's funny? Actually, I didn't think they let me take my shirt off for that film. They had me in this like yellow rash guard the whole time. And they also, for some reason, they didn't want Maya and I to kiss in the first movie. But we, we kissed anyway. <laughs> Harry Styles this, Harry Styles that. Y'all be sleeping on Ross Lynch and missing out. Sorry, not sorry, but this man right here. <laughs> Sexy, a legend, chef's kiss, an absolute slut. <laughs> Love him. It's weird that slut's like a compliment now. How did that happen? I guess Harry Styles is like the dude right now. I guess it's always in comparison with Harry Styles, but it doesn't really need to be. We can both thrive and have a good time. I think Harry's dope. Ross Lynch could literally snap me in half and use me like a glow stick on a bonfire night. I think half of these tweets are from boys. Ross Lynch is daddy AF and I don't hear it enough. Well, I'm hearing it a lot today. <laughs> I want Ross Lynch to redacted, redacted, redacted me so hard that I redacted, redacted, redacted. What does redacted mean again? It's like beep. <laughs> That's funny. Religion. Ross Lynch's thighs. Really? My thighs? How do you see my thighs? Sweet. I'm a hockey player, so like, I have thicker legs, I guess. <laughs> when I lick Ross Lynch's happy trail till I get rug burn on my tongue. <laughs> Dang. I think it's, it's funny too because this is when I lick, but I don't know this person. Man, people are creative on Twitter. They really are. Ross Lynch is for the gays? No, babe. He's for all the sluts out there. <laughs> Actually, I'm in, a, I'm in a relationship currently. My next song coming out, our next song, As the Driver Era, it's called Fantasy. You can listen to that and fantasize all you want. <laughs> Ross Lynch could suffocate me and I'd resurrect just to say thank you. <laughs> Man, that, that was pretty good, that was pretty good. I don't care if I'm a lesbian. I would let Ross Lynch rail me. Wow, that's a pretty cool compliment, thank you. I also like girls. So that's cool. <laughs> I want Ross Lynch to choke me with his thighs. That person's definitely a wrestler. I would literally let Ross Lynch blow my whole back out any day of the week, any hour of the day. Damn. I would eat Ross Lynch's ass. <laughs> I would do anything that man asked of me. Oh, well, I probably wouldn't ask you to do that. Just sadly living another day knowing Ross Lynch still has not murdered this bussy with a B, but I think we all know what she means. <laughs> That's pretty funny. We're really getting into some thirst tweets for sure. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna say it. I'm a hole for Ross Lynch. Damn. <laughs> People 
<laughs> it's so funny to me that people tweet this. I woke up from my nap to tell everyone that I would suck Ross Lynch off. Okay, good night. See, like, there's no way her mom follows her. There's no way. Maybe that's like an account that she just like is anonymous behind, like not even her friends follow or something. It's interesting. It's very interesting. Well, guys, that was thirst tweets about me, Ross Lynch, with BuzzFeed. I hope you liked it. I think it's really interesting that people feel comfortable to announce those desires. <laughs> I hope you enjoy the art that I create. We're on tour right now. We got a record coming out on September 16th. The band's called The Driver Era. The summer mixtape, the focus track's called Fantasy. So if you're feeling this kind of way, you can listen to that song and fantasize all you want. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe and comment and like and everything like that. And uh, I'll see you next time, BuzzFeed.